he was just the nicest guy. Was he? Kevin Gilbert's old photo albums. Funny story, this is standing on top of the Oval Office looking down. Are full of familiar faces. Affectionately known as Shrub. Shrub? Little Bush. Four presidents of the United States who he photographed during 25 years at the Washington Times. I did a lot of professional sports, a lot of travel, international news but my real love was covering the White House. His first assignment was Ronald Reagan. He snapped this photo before the president left for a summit with Mikhail Gorbachev, a meeting that changed history. Every time Reagan came into the room or did anything, it was inspiring. He just felt this tingle, something I never felt with Bush, but I felt it with Clinton and I felt it with Obama, that these guys have this, there's something about them that's really incredible. President Bush was likable. He was just the sweetest guy. He was so nice, he, he knew your name, he knew your kid's name. I have uh, triplets. And he would always just kind of say, hey Kevin, how's that outfield doing? President Clinton kept the press at more of an arm's length, but he understood the power of a lens. Always photogenic. They, they, did it right for the cameras. Of all the pictures Kevin took during the Clinton-Gore years, one clearly stood out. The annual White House Easter egg roll. The president put the whistle up to his mouth and blew the whistle. Well, these kids, instead of pushing them, actually flung them. And these, you know, hard-boiled eggs went flying over the president and the first lady, and she just, you know, just laughed and was like, oh my gosh, look at what's happening. Those kind of little moments are really genuine. You can never set that up. The final president he covered was George W. Bush. Once on the campaign plane, I was tired and I just kind of put my head back and went to sleep for a little bit. And suddenly I felt this kind of punch on my shoulder and I just kind of said, you know, what the? That was President Bush, or at that time Governor Bush. And he said, hey, new guy, no sleeping on my plane. And he just kept going. You know, he's just a jokester that way. After a quarter century inside one Oval Office, Kevin left it for another serving as a consultant for NBC's The West Wing. I'm in a few episodes as part of the press. My 15 minutes of fame is about 30 seconds. <laughs> he went on to shoot for a variety of TV shows before finally trading the Beltway for Bellevue. I've dedicated the last five or six years uh, of my life to helping people go from typical to better, to make a better photograph. Whether it's taken inside the White House or your own house. The pictures I'm most proud of are pictures I probably took yesterday because every day is a new, a new adventure, a new memory.